Could AT-4 light anti-armor weapons actually replace rocket-propelled grenades? The AT-4, also known as the M136 in the U.S. military, is a portable, single-shot firearm designed to be used against tanks and other armored vehicles. It is a lightweight, easy-to-use weapon that can be carried and fired by a single individual. The AT-4 is a recoilless weapon, which means that it uses the energy from the firing of the round to counterbalance the recoil of the launcher. This allows the weapon to be fired from the shoulder without the need for a heavy tripod or other support, making it highly portable. So the AT-4 is a shoulder-fired, smoothbore weapon that fires a fin-stabilized, high-explosive, anti-tank heat round. The round is encased in a disposable fiberglass launch tube, which is discarded after the round has been fired. This design allows the AT-4 to be relatively lightweight and easy to carry, as the launcher does not need to be reloaded. It is equipped with an adjustable sight that allows the user to aim the weapon accurately at targets at ranges up to 300 meters. The AT-4 also has a built-in backup iron sight in case the primary sight fails or is not available. It has a number of safety features built into it to prevent accidental discharge. These include a safety catch on the trigger, a safe-to-fire indicator, and a pressure-sensitive firing pin. The AT-4 is generally used in a direct-fire role, meaning that it is aimed directly at the target and fired from a relatively short range. This allows the user to take advantage of the weapon's armor-piercing capabilities. The AT-4 heat round is designed to defeat armor by using a shaped charge to create a high-velocity jet of molten metal that can penetrate through the armor plating of a vehicle. The jet is created when a small charge at the front of the round is ignited, causing a chemical reaction that generates a high-temperature plasma. This plasma is focused by a conical liner inside the round, creating the jet that can penetrate through armor. The AT-4 has a number of variants, including the AT-4CS, confined space, which is designed for use in urban environments or other areas where the backblast from the weapon could be dangerous. The AT-4CS has a reduced backblast and a special round that creates less smoke, making it easier to use in confined spaces. Other variants of the AT-4 include the AT-4HS, high sensitivity, which has a more sensitive fuse that is designed to detect thin armor or reactive armor, and the AT-4HE, high explosive, which has a HE warhead that can be used against structures or other non-armored targets. The AT-4 is used by many military forces around the world and has proven to be an effective weapon against a variety of armored targets. It is particularly useful in urban and other close quarters combat situations where it can be used to engage enemy armor vehicles that might otherwise be able to approach unseen. Now let's answer the original question if AT-4 weapons can actually replace RPGs. Well, it is unlikely that the AT-4 light anti-armor weapon could completely replace rocket-propelled grenades in all situations. While the AT-4 has some advantages over RPGs, such as its lightweight and portable design, it also has some limitations that make it less suitable for certain roles. One of the main advantages of the AT-4 is its portability. It can be carried and fired by a single individual and does not require a heavy tripod or other support. This makes it well suited for use in urban or other confined spaces where RPGs might be more difficult to use. However, the AT-4 has a much shorter range than most RPGs, with an effective range of around 300 meters. This makes it less suitable for use in open or long-range engagements, where RPGs would have a significant advantage. In addition, the AT-4 is generally more expensive than RPGs, which could make it less appealing to some militaries or other users. Overall, it is likely that the AT-4 and RPGs will continue to coexist, 
with each weapon being used for the roles that it is best suited for. The AT4 portability and ease of use make it a valuable asset for use in close quarters combat or urban environments, while RPGs will continue to be the weapon of choice for engaging targets at longer ranges or against heavily armored vehicles. Despite its limitations, the AT-4 has proven to be a valuable asset on the modern battlefield due to its ability to be carried and fired by a single individual, combined with its armor-piercing capabilities, and is likely to remain in service with military forces for the foreseeable future. If you enjoyed this content, please don't forget to like and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can always get to watch more incredible videos like this. This has been High Technology, serving you the best and cutting-edge content on the highest form of technology. Stay tuned for our next videos.